the man who helped turn the University of Maryland, Baltimore County into a nationally renowned institution is saying goodbye. Dr. Freeman Rabowski announced he is retiring. And WJZ is live right now. In the last two hours, Kelsey Kushner talked to the president about this decision and the legacy, the remarkable legacy he's leaving behind. Kelsey? Denise, well, 35 years he spent here at UMBC, 30 of them as president. President Rabowski tells me that he is ready to retire. He says this campus is more than just a community. It is family. He calls it home. And he says that he couldn't be more proud of what he's leaving behind. After three decades at UMBC, President Rabowski announces his retirement at the end of the school year. Known as one of the nation's longest serving presidents, President Rabowski has turned this school into a national model for producing minority scientists and engineers. He tells WJZ, although it's an emotional announcement, he feels confident his legacy will live on. UMBC is in my blood and my wife's blood. We are, we are a part of UMBC. And and UMBC is, is in our DNA. It's bittersweet in the sense that it's a great time to leave. It has been home. It's hard to say how to be as excited on the one hand and yet as humble on the other. Now, state and local leaders have been reacting to the announcement in a, tw in a tweet. Governor Larry Hogan said in part that he has inspired so many with his actions, words, and dedication. His commitment to supporting students from underrepresented groups has transformed higher education not only here in Maryland, but around the world. Reporting live, Kelsey Krishner for WJZ.